have two aisles. What's up, you guys? Go. Welcome back to a new Army Fam vlog. We are on the way to where? Hawaii. The boys are talking. Wait. We're talking really soft right now because we're on the airplane. But um, I'm so excited because this is like our first time going to Hawaii. I have DJ right here. Saya. Babe. Yeah. I'm sorry we all get to sit next to each other. I was like so like tripping off that but we have family boarding so thank god you guys we arrived I'm so excited after six long hours we made it are you guys tired? I feel like I feel like I'm sleepy but I'm I'm last one off the plane has to clean it um I don't know what we're gonna do, but right now we're gonna get situated. We stopped in Maui first. That took like an hour just to come to Honolulu. Um, because we had to wait for everybody and stuff. So, yeah, we had one stop in Maui and then we're here in Honolulu now. And actually, you guys, let me update you guys. It's my and Gigi's and Sia's first time in Hawaii. But Emilio actually has been to Hawaii before once to Maui because he had a soccer team. And you guys, he. Like when he played soccer with serious, like he had tournaments like all over like the United States. Like he went to Chicago for soccer, like different states. And like, wow, that's so cool. Like being a kid and like traveling for soccer. Like that must have been dope. Does it meet you one day? It is. You gotta speak it to me soon. So we're just waiting to get off my back. Like uh, it's an extreme pain. You guys, this is freshly out of the airport. Look it, it's so green. Isn't like this is me? pretty to me. I want to climb that shit so bad. This is this would be like this is like the greatest thing on earth if I was ten years old again. I'd try to climb that. Shit. I know climbing on the branches. It's so pretty. It must be old. But then like look it. Oh my god, this is what I love about Hawaii. How green it is. The boys seem over it. Oh my god. You could take I'm off your hungry. sweater. You're hungry. We're gonna eat something right now. Okay, you guys, I should have like vlogged while I was packing, but you guys, I always I have a habit of doing this. I literally just bought, like I bought everything brand new for us because it's Hawaii, so I bought everything floral. And like with pineapples, it's just very Hawaiian vibes. Like when you think of Hawaii, you think of like the flowers, like just flowers and like the collar shirt. So I literally got, I was in charge of doing all the orders for me at Amido San Diego. I literally just packed, like I, I literally just bought stuff like that and bring like normal, not neutral color like vibes, right? So everybody on the internet was like, oh my god, and Amira was like, babe, that's all you, like everything's like all uh, flowers and stuff. But I kind of started feeling embarrassed, like wow, I'm being such a tourist right now, like just hella, like how much every day going to be in something with flowers? So, um... Everybody was messaging me saying like, Brit, like, well, it was like half and half. Like, a lot of people were like, Brit, like, what the fuck do you, like, like, be yourself, like, whatever you want, like, you know, that's the point of Hawaii. And then some people were like, girl, we dress normal over here. But mind you guys, I'm in the tourist side of town. I'm, in, I'm going to Waikiki Beach. So, I mean, we're going to be spread it out everywhere. We're going to be like all over the place. But, so tell me why more point of the story is that I'm here at the airport and I'm seeing a lot of people with the colored flower shirts so I don't feel too embarrassed anymore because I fit in oh my god you guys I didn't even get the chance to show you our hotel like how we look but I got ready in like five Ooh. minutes oh my god you scared me don't we do that um we're hungry because we haven't eaten since yesterday like literally I brought granola bars with me like from home and so we had a granola bar but that's about it um, but we're already we're gonna go get something to eat. The bo all the boys decided to wear the jerseys. I don't know what for. No, we don't have everything to do with that. Look at our resort. It's so pretty. So this you can see the ocean from right here. Come on. I'm excited to try Hawaiian food. Like I've had Hawaiian food like Al and Al, but like I want to try like authentic, authentic um, Hawaiian food. So this is um, I'm gonna keep doing this. 
So this is just one tower, the Rainbow Sweet patio, but I love it. It's so pretty. There's there's like stores inside. There's actually like hella stores, huh, around here, babe? Well, they got like the typical like, turf stuff. No, but the even side. they have like a Louis Vuitton store. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is um, our pool. I like it because it's like right here. As soon as we're out of our hotel. <sighs> Look at the fish. So pretty. There's so many hotels there. Oh, I forgot to mention. So the hotel I was staying at is the Hilton Waikiki Beach Resort. So I chose this one because I did like a lot of research on a lot of the um, resorts. This one's like really affordable and like the price is right for this one. Like everything that comes with it's so good. I've seen others and I was like, mm, no. So this is like the lobby. You come out. Oh, I forgot to get my tapatio packet. Should we get pizza? Right now, yeah. Just really pizza. Yeah, I don't care. I'm just starving. I need something. Else. We have not ate, guys. We actually were all hungry right now. See, you guys, like, there goes the Louis Vuitton store. So you come out of our lobby. There's a Louis V store right there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but look, right there, Louis Vuitton. And there's so much stores right here. So I really like that. Our resort, you come out, and there's like so many stores. Which probably is so expensive, but we're gonna have pizza. Oh, and this is what I'm wearing today. So, this is, I came out fast because I get five minutes. This is my Hawaii outfit for today. So, I did pretty good, no flowers. No, you're still in the flowers. Look, everywhere's flowers. Everywhere's flowers. You guys, I love that Hawaii is two hours behind because every time I travel anywhere, I always lose time. Um, and here I get to gain time, so it's a plus for me because when I went to New York, you guys, I was waking up at 1 p.m. and here, it's gonna be perfect. I cannot believe this is like the first thing that we're eating in Hawaii. So we got a, what's called a Maui Zowie. So that should be interesting. Okay, grab it. I mean, we got wings too. I'm so hungry. Okay, guys, so we made it to the beach. The beach is so pretty. Oh my God, I love it. You cannot find a more better beach than this. It's so pretty. There's so much people at 6 p.m. right now. This is a sunset at 6 p.m. Look you guys, the pineapple truck, it's so cute. Oh, and they have shaved eyes, coconuts. This is so pretty. I wish we had this in the beaches of California. Southern Cali. I really want to try shaved ice, so like for real. And look at the bus. That's my dream bus for the beach. Because I'm a beach bum. I love the beach so much. So the middle knows that I really want a car like that. The Volkswagen. Like Volkswagen. Buggy. Oh look, everybody's catching the sunset right now. Yeah, it's going down. Yeah. They're probably going down. You want it? Yeah. It don't matter. That's it, the Voltsy. The Okay, so we were thinking that they weren't able to get in the pool because at six o'clock the pool closes, but what the fuck, everybody's still in the water. Yeah, fuck these motherfuckers, we paid for this shit. What the fuck, they gonna tell me to get <laughs> out the pool at six o'clock? The are right now. I wanted, is it warm? Yeah? Okay. It's warm, huh? It's not that warm. It's not that warm? Babe, I don't know, because you said the ocean one. <laughs> no! Totally warm. Oh, no, it's 
It's cold. That shit is cold. It is not cold, baby. It's, you said the ocean is cold and I touch it and it's warm. Come in the middle. See how deep it is. JJ. Careful when there's people coming. Okay, go. It's okay. Stop. Hey, don't tell each other like that. Be careful. There's steps right there, so be careful. But look at how beautiful it is. I would love to be in the Luau right now. Luau? Luau. A Luau. I love how everything has like lights, like the light bulbs. The fire like ones? that's so Hawaii, yeah. Like the, the fire ones, like those. This should be the most Hawaii thing ever because we're in Hawaii. Yeah. You guys, sorry, I was like, let me know SpongeBob. I'm like, let me know what know because he didn't even watch SpongeBob growing up. I know about that. That's the squeaky boots. The long squeaky boots. Remember? Hi, yeah. How did you guys like being in the water? It's warm. It's warm. Tomorrow we could get back in it. No, the beach. Or the beach, whichever. I don't know. <laughs> no, the The what? The it's warm, huh? You guys, I, I let Sai borrow my slides because like, he fits into my slides. Okay, so we're gonna go to Walmart, you guys, because there's a lot of stuff that we like. I need lots of water and like just snacks, stuff like that, just to, to keep us throughout the whole entire time that we're here. So we're gonna go to Walmart, we're gonna get some snacks, essentials, water, stuff like that. What the fuck? I wish my Walmart had an L and L. What the fuck? Okay, so let's get what we need. Kimchi. We came to the snack section, and this is how the Hawaiian snacks look like: fried squid. Mm. No, thank you. These are not my type of snacks. Everything here. No. Look. Can somebody tell me what this is and is it good? What is this shit? Squid. What is it? I don't know. This crazy. I wanna try it. Oh look the mingo, I like mingo. Hi no wait, lie hing. Powder. Lemon sugar. Prune the salt, powder? sugar, licorice. Made in Japan. So th I think this is a cultural stuff. No, this is a, no, babe, we're in the, I think, yeah, this has to be like Japanese stuff as well because I see a lot of it. Yeah. You guys, we just got home from Walmart and I'm so exhausted, you guys. Like, I'm literally on four hours of sleep. If not less, you know before traveling somewhere you can't sleep the night before because you just have anxiety because you think you're going to forget something and you think something just bad's going to happen. I always get anxiety like when I know I'm going to travel because I'm like, like, you know, like crazy things happen when you travel somewhere and I'm sick. I'm so scared. Like, I don't want anything to happen, but I'm like ready to knock out. We got so much snacks. The boys. Took a shower and they're just. What are you doing, babe? Uh, just this ice. And then we don't want to go get ice. Good morning, everyone. Today's day two. I feel a lot more better, relieved. I'm not so exhausted anymore. This is my outfit. Um, me and Amino, and this is a kid, so I have to call it. I got them little Hawaii outfits to match life. They already have their goggles on, they're ready. They're ready. Um, we're just gonna go. We actually rented a car for the day. And, come in, So we rented a car for the day. Where are we going, babe? We're going to a botanical garden first. Um, that one of the locals said we have to check. Like he said, we're doing Hawaii all wrong. Yeah, he said that we're doing fake Hawaii. So we wanna do real Hawaii. So we're gonna get out of the city and 
to the driveway. Okay, so this is our resort, how it looks during the day. Well, I think I showed you guys during the day. I'm not sure yesterday I was so busy. But, so we're gonna run a car. I'm so happy because we can finally try like real Hawaiian food. I really wanna eat real Hawaiian food. Like, so that's what we're gonna have for breakfast. And then we're gonna go to this little like hiking spot to take cute, nice pictures. And then we're gonna go to this nice beach. It's kind of like, the water is precious. It's nothing like this water that we have right here. So we're trying to do Hawaii the right way. So this is, we're just cruising around guys. We just got our rental, we got a Prius. And you guys, the weather is perfect, right? Feels good. I don't, it's, it's, it's not super humid, like, I it's thought. really, no, I was gonna say it's kind of humid, it's in the middle of being humid, but, but it's like, okay. like light humidity, like, not, not compared like to Cancun. Miami or Cancun, yeah, yeah, it's not but that it's so cute. I love Hawaii so far. Ramiro is saying Cancun is better, Cancun is better. Beaches, I think the greenery definitely takes this, but of course, over here they don't have all inclusive resorts, so the plan is to get out of the resort. So anyways, um, our resort is like, it's not uninclusive. So, but I heard that the Hilton, Waikiki Beach Village, whatever it's called, is like the best in Waikiki Beach. So I love that hotel. And they also do fireworks every Fridays at eight o'clock. So I think that's really cute too. Um, but anyways, um, yeah, I mean, I was like obsessed with Cancun, which don't get me wrong, I love Cancun too. Like. That's why we've been there. Like, I, I've been there like five times now because I'm just obsessed. If I can go, if I could choose Cancun, I would again. But I wanted to do something different with the kids, something we've never done, um, and just to just to have that experience and say we've to done build it. Memories and more than yeah. But Amiro's mom's I, obsessed. Dude, with yeah, Hawaii. she's been here over 15 times. I've done Cancun like 15 times, but she she's like infatuated with with Hawaii. Like I don't know what it is about her in Hawaii, but you know what? She likes island hopping. Okay, so me and Amira are trying to look for a spot to eat at right now. And I'm so not familiar with this food, like, whatsoever. So we ended up coming to L&L. We ended up finding it right here really quick. Um, I know there's, like, more legit authentic spots like this. I heard this is, like, the fast food style of Hawaiian food. And plus, we have it in California. So I was kind of disappointed because I really want to try, like, authentic, authentic versions. But L&L was pretty good, so it's okay. Okay guys, we are entering the facility. Are we gonna see a dinosaur? Maybe, perhaps. Yeah, JJ, Barney's gonna be here. Barney? Yeah. Barney the dino. Those are the type of questions you ask me. Like, hey, are we gonna see Barney here today? He, he really asked if there's gonna be snow on top of the mountain. <laughs> like, no, it isn't snow. No, there is some parts of snow in Hawaii. I've seen, look, people are walking here, babe. <gasps> Look it. So this is a botanical. Yeah, botanical garden. Botanical. Mm -hmm. Garden. And what is this basically? A tourist. Uh, what do you mean? Like a like a rainforest? It's a rainforest. Yeah, and like it's so like pretty. That. Oh my god. Loco Guamalogia. Yeah. Guamalogia. I don't know. I love that. Hawaiian names. I think if I have a daughter, I want to give her Hawaiian name. They're so pretty, like, they're so, like, I don't know how to Aloha pronounce them, so fuck, like, people are gonna probably gonna be pissed. I don't know how to pronounce them, this shit's hella high. It'll be like, ho, ho, ma, 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 ma. What's the beach that we're going to? Waiamanea? Oh, I don't know. I don't See, even know I what like it is. I like that name, Waiamanea. 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 What the hell? This is so pretty. Okay, so where can we get up to take pictures? Not yet, huh? No, they said, remember, pull up about a mile down. Oh, okay, here's the parking lot. Okay. Whoa, this is crazy as hell. Alright guys, so we're actually on a path to a lake that they have here at the Botanical Garden. And uh, I guess it's a 10 minute slippery walk. Um, we and have muddy. the missus with her. She's ready for a Chat photo nice. shoot here. I want to She's the only shoot. lady here with the f ready for a photo shoot. I brought my um, camera and everything so I was holding it. Yeah. Why so we're... We got a whole bunch of things going on. Um, this is really, really close as well to where they shot Jurassic World and Jurassic Park, I believe, but as well. You know what? It's kind of cold. 
77 degrees. It's really, really perfect weather to be honest. Well, where are you? It's more sunny, huh? In uh, Waikiki? Mm. Now we're here because it showed them the sky. Look, it's so steamy. It's clouds? clouds. Wow. Brittany keeps saying that that's steam from a volcano, even though there's not an active you know, volcano here. But we'll just go with what have. we'll just go with what Brittany said. It could be. It's the things of the sky, you know. It's Look at how pretty wow. this is. Wow. I still have not had my first mai tai. Sorry, guys. What's that? <laughs> Sorry, guys. Well, they looked at you crazy because they're like mai tai. Look, what is this? Pandanus. That is. That looks like flan. Bro, that's what I was thinking huh. right now. Looks like flan? No, that looks nothing like flan. Yeah, it does. It looks like cake. That looks like cake. It could be a bowl. <coughs> so this is a how Panama hats are made, I guess, from this plant. Um, we had recently gone to San Juan and bought some, bought some hats for Papa, and he was really, really juiced about it. So we're calling him now. Hi, Papa. Aloha, beautiful. Aloha. I'm in Hawaii. I know. Look, I wanted to show plant? you this. Ask him, does he know this plant? Do you know this plant? Oh, up, up, up. Look, they make your hats out of them. They make your... They're the... Uh, they're the pa uh, your Panama hats. That's what they make Panama hats with. Yep. yep. Alright guys, we made it to the lake. And... Look what awaits us. Holy shit. Wait, there's like, one piece of dude, there's like, Why is there so many fish? Um, there, it's a lake. Why is there so many gold? Like they're like gold. Because they put them in there. This is crazy. So pretty. This is so crazy. I want to touch one. No, and they want to eat. Uh, I know they're waiting to... Eat? I'm pretty sure. What do they feed them? I don't know yet. I know they always just toss stuff, the little food to them. But look, look how this guy's guy. Look how it looks. This is so crazy. We got the boys right here. And like in 20 years, they'll look back at this and be like, what the hell, we went to Hawaii. And they won't take it for granted in 20 years. Trust me. Huh, babe? Yeah. I feel like it's like... Dude, this feels fake. I swear, I feel like some random dinosaur is just about to fucking come down. I was thinking, I feel like coming to Hawaii is like such a luxury, like to come and get to explore being here. S anybody going on a vacation is uh, I anywhere. I feel like we're super blessed. Like, hopefully, we can do this we can again? make this a tradition and we, we could do every, We continue every year with the kids how we do it. Yeah, hopefully God still blesses us in so many ways because I would have never thought that I would be able to travel with my kids. And like we get to just like last no two years ago we went to Cancun with the family. This year Hawaii. We try to do like like we went to where did we go? Arizona? Arizona with the kids. We try to take They've been on cabins. a lot of vacations for yeah, they have for the their age. Age, yeah. I didn't I didn't I mean I only knew Mexico at my There's age. Lots of Brittany kids. didn't Brittany didn't know anything. No. She knew Papa's house. Only Papa's house on the weekends. We got dropped <laughs> off there. <laughs> oh, so this pretty. is nice. Okay guys, so we're leaving now. I tried to change into a different outfit to take pictures, but whew, that was a fail too. I just, I'm not liking the vibes of how I look right now. I didn't really have a chance to do my makeup. I got ready super fast so we could like head out faster. So I feel like that's why I'm like not really feeling myself, but it's okay. As long as like the kids are out having fun and I'm just vlogging for you guys, I feel like it's okay, it's not always about pictures, but I'm tired. I'm exhausted from hiking. I didn't, even, I didn't, I brought hiking clothes, but I didn't bring it with me right here. So look. Are you guys tired, boys? Yeah. yeah. You tired? Yeah. We made it to the beach. I forgot what it was called. I think it's- You guys, look at how pretty it is. Like, oh my God, I can't wait to show you guys how it looks like the water so pretty so pretty show them can't really see from here but this looks like redwood trees but they're kind of small kind of these are way way small dude these birds look crazy i've never seen these type of birds anywhere all right guys now you can appreciate the view shit i got that view too right there nice look at this it looks so pretty Everything. Super, super pretty. 
vibes, you guys. What vibes are you guys giving me? To Mexico, right? And look at the look at this. Look how clear this water is, right? You cannot stay in Waikiki Beach and win this. Week. We went to the back side of the island, rented a car. They have this app, it's called uh, Huey, H-U-I, H-U-I. And uh, you get a rent it for the day, it comes with gas, everything for a full day, and I think it was only like 1.30. Same thing as getting, you know, paying for these tours, so. It's better to just explore the island and figure it out, but. We ended up having an Uber driver yesterday that kind of told us where to go and what to do. And uh, he grew up here, so he told us, no, you guys are doing Hawaii wrong. Come over here. And check it out. This is so beautiful. You guys like literally I recommend this beach instead. It's Waia Manalo. Waia Manalo oh, something what? like that. Is it warm? Huh? Is it warm? Yeah, it's warm. I haven't touched the water yet. And look at the big mountain over there. Looks nice, super nice. This water's warm as hell that I'm walking to. Don't want to mess up the camera. Uh oh. I might get the camera wet. I'm gonna get the camera wet. Guys, this shit is fucking clear. Shit, I hope no fucking fuck fucks up or nothing. It's like way sketchy. Ah! So yeah, it looks super nice. Super duper nice. This shit looks like a fucking lock screen from your, comp your teacher's computer desk. Shit is crazy. Super, super crazy. The kids doing their wave defense, supposedly. Wow. Way to go. Way to go. What happened? We almost had that. But there's a spot right here. All right, guys. So we're like two hours in and we're still here. I just didn't even I literally just got so wet. I hope we don't get the camera wet because I literally, I wasn't even. Oh, shit. Those little fishes, when we end up letting the waves crash, you it's get to see. Uh oh, here's a big one. No. You guys, I'm so. Oh my God. Ah! What was I thinking? I need to get out. I need to get out. I was in here, you guys, for like 40 minutes. And it was fun. The water's warm. I highly recommend this beach. I freaking love this beach so much. But, oh my God. Let me get out. Oh, oh shit. It's like deep on this part. Okay. We made it. The sand, softest sand I've ever touched in my life. Softer than Cancun's, I'll tell you that. Way softer than Cancun's beach. There's sand. It's so pretty. But, ooh, getting out, I'm cold. And you guys, look at the trees. So pretty. The kids are still in there. But I'm hungry now, so I think we're gonna get something to eat soon. So we just um, we just dropped off our rental car and now we're just walking our little hotel like this area and like we're gonna eat right here at this blue water shrimp. It looks pretty poppin', it looks pretty good, so we'll see how it goes. So this is what's like on the menu you guys. Like I said, I'm not really like too familiar with this type of food, but we shall try it. Um, and it's so cute, like look how it looks. And I also got a fresh coconut. Okay, so I got steak, shrimp, and corn. Damn, this is a lot of food. Um, potato salad and rice. JJ got the same thing. I told you you weren't gonna finish it. And then Saya got fish and chips. 
Who thought? So I was gonna share with you? I wish I brought my tapatio, but I don't have none. This is Ramiro's place, it's like a seafood platter, and then sorry about fish and chips. I hope you like it, sorry, okay. Pretty good. The world fried. The fried. Good morning, you guys. We just woke up. Um, so today is the Niner game, guys, and who do you guys think is going to win? Because Ramiro is going for the Niner so hard. He's so upset because... Brian and Fernando planned to go watch a Niner game in Santa Clara last minute. Had we have known that, we would have literally... I would have last minute canceled this. No, I swear babe. To God, I we would have um, planned Hawaii like next weekend instead because, oh, we're so sad. You guys, I'm not like a sports person at all. I don't even have a team or anything. Well, I go for the Niners because they're middle day. So I support... Last time we went to a Niner game, she stayed on her phone making a TikTok for about three hours and I know. deleted it after. Yeah, I deleted it. But I love going to the games. I don't care, like, if I don't watch yeah, it or anything. Like, it's fun because you just get drunk and, like, hearing the noise and how people... And then, babe, we were following the rules, like, going like that and, like, <laughs> doing those noises. Oh, God. So I was kind of paying attention a little bit. But anyways, um, the boys are ready. Say hi. Sir, you have this backwards. You need to flip it. Ramiro is wearing his name, it's just he. Yeah, it is. Okay. That's the front. I came sporty vibes because we're going to go to a sports bar to watch the game. For Ramiro, since he can't go, since he couldn't go to the game, we're just going to watch it at a sports bar. But you guys, I don't care. As long as we're in Hawaii having fun with the kids, to me, that's all that matters. But I do wish I could have been a part of that, so. What else? It is what it is. But we're gonna go eat. It's what time is it right now? Yeah. Eleven thirty-seven. We're two hours behind. So the Niner game starts at five, and over here it's gonna start at three. So we're gonna go keep, eat breakfast and then probably go to a sports bar, and then after we'll do, do activities with the kids. Okay, guys. So there's this cute little aesthetic spot that I've been wanting to try. It's called Mai Tai Bar. Everybody's been telling me about it. So I really, really want to go. So we got here. And I haven't ate. The boys ate McDonald's. They wanted that so bad. And I'm like, I'm not eating McDonald's in Hawaii. So thank you. So we're going to try Mai Tai Bar and try the food and the drinks. I have not had any alcoholic beverages like not even a pina colada like nothing oh look there it goes this is it it's called my tie my ties like we've been playing the game mm -hmm. so are you happy about that you guys are middle so sad like he's all nine it out and he couldn't go to the game with Brian Turn. but are you happy here with us of course what do you mean? No, that's a fake smile. Stop. Okay, guys, so I got. I didn't get a Mai Tai. I'm so sad. How do I come in and get a Mai Tai? And it's called Mai Tai. I came to this spot for a Mai Tai, but the girl was like, this one's the best, and it's a meal, and I love meals, so it's really good. We got a cheeseburger, and we got ceviche, and then the kids already ate at McDonald's. But we're here watching the game. What game is this, anyways? Divisional playoff game? So is it an important one? Very, very important. If you lose, you go home. Oh, if you lose, you go home. Okay, guys, so we just came to a different bar to watch the game. Skybox. Uh, Skybox. Lounge, I believe it's called. Lounge. But this is lightweight bougie. The middle's kind of upset now because he's like, I thought it was going to be like more hood. So... I mean, I don't care about the hood. I just like... like actually, no, baby. I'm kind of scared, especially being in this area we don't know nothing about. We're what in, is it? We're in America, bud. I know, Don't but worry. we're in an island. We can't. It's fine. We're in America. Same laws exist. If we were in Mexico, then we're. We're fucked. Yeah, I'm not worried here. So this is it. It's called Skybox. Oh, and by the way, I changed my outfit, you guys. Um, um, I can't believe Brie and Fern are there at the game currently right now, and we're in Hawaii. We came to this little bar. And look at the view. It's beautiful. And we also just got pizza for now. You guys, let me know how it's bad anxiety. No way. Bad anxiety. I want to start watching. 
watching the game be... Yeah, watch the game. It's so hard for me to pay attention because I don't get it. But the middle says that he's going to run inside the beach if we win. No, so. it's, not that, it's not that serious. No, not you said that. that. I know, I was just playing though. I'm not really going to do that. No, you said that. that. Hell no. Man is supposed to win. This ain't a... Uh, Oh, oh. I learned that so far, so. That ain't right now. I'm That's there in spirit see. with my sister and my friends. Getting fucked up, drinking the tequila bottle. Good fucking hit. Good fucking hit. You guys, so we're still here. We're on the fourth quarter. Right now we have six minutes and we're losing. We're losing our bet. Fuck oh. our bet. Get him, get him. He just wants our... Let's fucking go! Let's go! Let's go! I just want our team to win. I just want our team to win we're and... We're here for the Yeah, we're just here for the bet. Fuck, we're right? fucking over. Fuck it, even if our bet don't go through, as long as the team goes fuck. through, that's it. I said fuck the bet. I just want to win the game. First down! First down! Oh, oh, oh! Look at this shit. We're gonna take pictures with Harris. Alright, look at this shit. In a second. It's just the flirt. We call him a flirt, but what do you this tell the man? A baby. What do you tell the man? But what do you tell the pretty woman? They don't escape. Alright, you want to take a picture? <laughs> Sister, have you been around the island yet? No. Yes. Yeah, we have. Around the island? Yeah, we have. Because I tell tours. Another baby. Oh, the baby. Another baby. Paper flash. The camera pictures. What the fuck? We're gonna get this. And what do you tell the men? Oh. And what do you tell all the pretty women? <laughs> and what do you tell this lady? He's biting me now. Look. Oh, oh no. Keep, oh, no. Keep your hand flat. Okay. <laughs> Coochie, coochie, coo. Go, you know. no, I mean, I'll go with right. your beam on. Right. You're gonna, you're gonna put your arm behind her waist. Just like that. Give me a shot right here. <laughs> Hold the hand down the left. Big palm. Hi! Yeah. Shaka, bro. Shaka, hang loose. Hang loose! Live from Wacky Wacky Waikiki. Wacky Wacky. Live from Waikiki Beach. You hear that shit? Oh, he spit on me. Don't, yeah. Give me two shots up. I can't. We're walking uh, down Waikiki. I don't know what this mall is called, but it is fucking cracking here. There's people everywhere, huh? Yeah. So much people. It's like this strip on Las Vegas. Yeah, but yeah. this is like the bougie strip, I'm guessing. Like, I don't know what the fuck it's that hotel, hotel is. Drive. Okay, guys, so we're gonna get in the water right now. We're gonna do late night swimming. This is what I love about our resort because our resort, they say 6 p.m. is the, the like, the last you can, um, you have to get out of the pool by 6 p.m., but that's not true. Right, Gigi? Yeah, not true. We've been getting in the pool after 6 p.m., like, till like 10. Huh, babe? Babe, can you get in the pool till like 10? We do whatever we want. We pay for this shit. David don't think he's a boss. Nuh-uh. Okay, so... Me and Josie, my friend, and we, I just met here, but she's also a girl, and we've met each other before. Besties now. Yes. We met each other before in Riverside, and um, so she's out here in Riverside and um, Hawaii, too. We're looking for vibes tonight. And we, we're staying in the same hotel, you guys.
stupid team mom. All right, so so some stupid dumb bitch Re was reversing at my mom's job site. Some dumb bitch that had two dogs in the car and didn't look in the back. <laughs> And he didn't see my mom, and he fucking dragged her like a fucking rag doll so under you guys, the car. She caught us right a little no, no, bit ago. My, She's my, fine. My dad called me and said, "Hey, I don't want you to worry, uh, but your mom got dragged by a fucking car." How the we fuck were, am no, I not gonna worry? You guys, we were shit? tripping. I told him, you know, no we way. could leave. We, I told him, you know, we could leave. Hawaii, I don't care, cause like if that was my mom, I would be like, yeah, and then my mom got yeah. pissed, cause my stepdad told me that. So my mom got mad at my stepdad and said, why the fuck are you even telling them this shit? Because <laughs> you're gonna ruin their fucking vacation. <laughs> so I told my mom what happened and she said, all I remember is waking up and I'm under a car and I see the, the, the axle moving no. under my fucking car and everybody screaming, telling me to get out. And my mom's like, I crawled out and my shit, I was just hurting everywhere. So I got in the ambulance and went to the fucking hospital. What the? Yeah, but um, uh, um, hot smoky fucked her up more than what the car did. Well, yeah, she got surgery with Smokey. She broke her, uh, Smokey broke his whole, her whole fucking wrist. He's, he dropped her, the alpaca She's dropped her. She's got a her. fucking cut from here to no here from way. Smokey. Yeah, and they put metal inside of her. So forever she has metal in her arm. But the car accident didn't. Oh. Yeah, she got x-rays on her whole body and she's like, I don't know how the fuck this didn't fuck me up compared to fucking Smokey. I'm fucking dead. Yeah, so she's good. Thank God. So I mom think, didn't die in the next one. Oh, okay. Go. It's a win-win. It's a win-win. Aloha. 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 Niner, Niner. Hey, hey let's go. Hey, hey. Good morning, you guys. So we just got up. We're ready already. We came to Mai Tai. It's at a different resort, but on the beach. And it's so beautiful and it's so aesthetically pretty. The boys are already. Say hi. Good morning. But look out. No, it's my Thai. This is the word. Babe, look, my Thai. My Thai bar? Oh, so just the bar, okay. So just the bar. Guys, change of plans. The food was not it for me. It was like too like. It wasn't for the kids either, so we left. But look at you guys, we're in the strip. It looks like Beverly Hills, huh? Yeah, just tropical. Just tropical Beverly Hills. Oh my god, it's so pretty. We're on the strip of Hawaii and they have like all the designer stores. like. Benji Dior, Louis Vuitton. It's right here? That's what it said. I finally found some fresh lace. And what's a traditional way? So Hawaiian traditional way of what we do here in Hawaii. So the man's your boyfriend or your husband, your spouse is supposed to give you a lay and lay you and give you a kiss. Oh, okay. Okay. So like this. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, Thank you. Guys, so we're just poolside chilling. Yep. Oceanside chilling. And you guys, I got my first. What is it called? Lay. Lay. I got my first lay. You got lay. And the kids are having so much fun on huh, GJ in the ocean. And I got my piña colada. And. The kids are just having a blast, so the vibes are on point. The sun isn't on point, though. I'll say that today. I like it like this. I don't like it. I want it to be the hot, be mean. This feels good. It's 79 degrees and no, no crazy sun. But it, I, I know, but like I don't like it. Is, Dude, is that normal for the, the the ship to be that close? What the, yeah, that that ship. That yeah, but it felt like I felt, it feels like they're gonna. Bump in. Okay, so it's fine. That's what it was this morning. It kind of scared me. So this is what Amido's outfit of the day. I got him that Hawaii shirt. Yeah, I was forced to wear it. You weren't forced. It was a choice. Okay, well, let me retract that. And this is a resort. It's so pretty. Everybody's just chilling. And you guys, she said that these are edible too, so if I get hungry, I'm scared to eat it though, but she said it's edible. Okay guys, so we ended up going back in the room because it started raining on us because right now we have like bad weather. Like it's so gloomy, there's no sun. There was honestly hardly no sun today. So the boys are dressed, we're just going to go get something to eat. I think we're going to do like a shrimp boil or something, this is my outfit. The kids. And 
and this is the kids' outfits. They're still very Hawaii vibes. And then Ramiro's Carhartt. King, not King's hat. Not really. No Hawaii vibes going on. All right, you guys. Me and the family came to Kickin Cajun. It's a little local. It's a little local spot here. They had a boiling crab and all that, but. I wanted to try something else. Um, they were telling me that this is like their own. That they were telling me that this is like their own uh, type of kicking crab. Sorry, not kicking crab. Uh, boiling crab. So I wanted to try theirs, and then they serve gator here. So I wanted to try gator, and I convinced the kids to try it with me. So I'm not. Watch, no, that. watch. It's, it tastes like chicken. No, I'm not. I, I don't. Tastes like chicken. Tastes like chicken. I just don't no, want that fire. hitting my organs. <laughs> Worst thing to your organs. Trust me, that shit is gonna be fire. It's, a, it's, a, it's, it's gonna blow your mind. And that's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys the food once we get here. All right, guys. So these are the gator bites. Thank you. French Tabasco. Thank you. So these are the gator bites. My gloves. So these are. So these are the gator bites. Um, they're really, really small. They look like chicken nuggets, and the kids ate it. They didn't know the difference between the chicken or if it was a uh, gator. Shit, they might be lying to us. It might not even be gator, to be honest. What do we know? You just want me to try it, and I'm not. It's okay. You don't have to. I don't want you to. But you gonna help? But you not eating it? Us? What's your story? You guys, I can't believe Dave decided to say that he can't wait for this trip to end so he can go play games with his friends online. No, Gaming. I said I can't wait to see my friends. And I told him one day when he's older and he's broke or something, he's not going to be able to do these tricks and look back and be like, damn. Sorry, Tom, you're so not going to be broke. You're going to be, no, you're going to have a whole head, uh, career ahead of you. No, I said. I said if. I not said I better. I said I better. Hi. Like Hello. 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 So when I, when I, was, like in, when I was in kindergarten, oh my God. I, I had a good old friend, the, uh, a good old friend that I know of for three days. And that friend, we were best buddies. And then? Then. Wait, you guys, I'm so freaking sad because I put snorkeling today with the sh baby sharks and turtles. And guess what? They called me and they said that we can't do it today. Today's your last day. Because high winds. high winds. So I was like, just refund me my money. But I'm so sad because I wanted to do like that activity with the kids. Even though they didn't even want to do that. All they want to do is just literally stay by the beach. That's all they requested. And they don't want to do activities. I'm like, Geez. so we're just going to, we rented a car again today. And we're going to take them again to the beach because that's what they request. Um, and then I want to do shave ice. Yeah, I got you. What's wrong with your face right here? Oh, I uh, shave and then I put crema, so it's getting irritated. Oh it's red, God, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, but uh, today's our last full day, and then tomorrow we leave. As soon as we wake up, we're leaving. So, yep. So I found this bar. It looks pretty questionable because it's like within a liquor store, but actually, these be the best ones. It's called Steak Grave. Um, we'll see, but it looks really good, like, you see, the music line, so, that's pretty good. Mm. Do you guys want chicken and noodles? What you do you want? It's good. Huh? You guys, I bought the kids so much, like, Jaden, don't do that to your shirt. I bought them so much Hawaii clothes and they keep putting on the same thing. Maybe I should have dressed them. So we just got our plate. This is where it's at. We're going to the beach now to eat our food. We're hungry. We're starving. The good thing is we left the room really early. And you guys, I heard about zippies. Everybody keeps telling me about zippies. We definitely need to try it. Oh Okay, so I bought my little package of tapatio. I can't wait to try this, you guys. So let me show you guys. This is how it looks. And then I got shrimp. Yeah, right now, before you guys get in the water, I want you guys to put sunscreen. 
And there ain't no better view. Ah, you guys can't even see my face. Okay, now you guys can see. Do you want tapatio? I need tapatio. Okay. Let's do a taste test. Are these garlic noodles? Really good. Did you guys attack it, boys? Oh no. Okay, so. Babe, what's this beach called? Lainakai. Lainakai. Lainakai Beach is so pretty. So as you guys can see, oh shit, we don't have too much sun going on. It's kind of cloudy. That's why they canceled on us because it is kind of windy, but it comes and goes, I feel like. Okay, guys, change of plans. We're going back to our beach that we like the best. We like Lainakai, but there's nothing like the other one, huh, babe? What is it called? Waimanalu. Waimanalu. That one's way better than Lainakai. Everybody was like, Lainakai, Lainakai. So we know we don't want to check it out because we want to be top, but... Honestly, you guys know. The other one has way more sand. It's prettier. And it's close. Let's go. See, this is what I'm talking about, you guys. This is the ocean and the beach that we love. This one right here. This is the one that, and then there's so much sand, you guys. The other one had no sand, like, and they didn't have, I don't know, this one's just my favorite. I love this one. So, come to, I dropped the location in here. Lina Kai Beach is nice, but ain't nothing better than this one. So, what do you think about our trip, babe? Good. Chill. It's chill? Yeah. And, um, what else? Did you like? Doing a family vacation with the kids, just us four, because it's like our only, yeah, the only good. time we've ever done this. Yeah, it was tight. It's chill. It's more like. I get no back. conversation out of this man, you guys. I'm tired, dude. Get this bacon sun right here at 80 degrees and try to think. Look, I'm trying to have a good conversation. Like up. Why are they moving like that? The world ending? No. Why well, am I looking? Oh no, it does look like that. It's moving. God damn, that's just fast as fuck. Let's get in the water. Yeah, don't you want to do your videos right now? Yeah, I want to do TikTok. All right, oh my god, Sai is all the way over there. What? Oh my god, he got pushed by the wave. Yeah, remember it's, it's only two feet right there? Yeah, it's really, it, it's really short. JJ. I want them to try to get on there. Thank God we got them the boys. See, they really came in handy. Oh, damn. Did you see that? Yeah, I seen, baby. Bro, did you see that? You got eight. No. Bro, I can't do that. I was riding the wave. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, you rode the wave, baby. You did. I surf. You surf? Surfing is on top. You gotta stand up. So, so I went back out. We gotta ride out more out. Okay guys, we just freshened up. We all took a shower. We packed everything in our hotel. So now we're gonna go get something to eat. I'm so sad because today is our last day at our resort. We leave tomorrow as soon as we wake up. Uh, what I noticed is we didn't really use this resort. No, we only used it one day, which was yesterday. Next time I'm gonna get an Airbnb or something. Yeah, honestly, you guys, there's so much to do in Hawaii that you don't even want to stay in your resort. Unless it's like an all-inclusive, then maybe, but, and like, hella fun stuff to do, but 
Other than that, it's not really a necessity to stay in your... Yeah, and, and like a nice hotel. Like even with kids, like you're better off renting a car and just exploring the island every day. So yeah, we rented a car for two days um, because other times we were close in our in Waikiki Beach. So to get an Uber was like really fast or it was like walking distance. So we only needed um, to rent a car for two days. Um, which, by the way, if you guys want to, I definitely recommend Huey. It's an app. It's yeah, called H-U-I. H-U-I and... And it's, it's damn near the same thing if you think about it. Cause it's the same thing, same cost. I think, I think we get full tank of gas, everything for Oh, and we keep getting, you know, we keep getting cars that are electric, so... Yeah, so regardless, it comes with a full tank of gas, everything, and uh, it's 110. And then another thing here is the parking here is like 75 bucks a night. Oh, yeah, so that's so what made me and Amido not want to rent a car because it's 75 dollars a night. We stayed here for six days. It would have been like Plus to rent bucks the car. To, no, it would have been like a thousand. Like a thousand with the rental of the car and the parking. Parking like, here. Fuck that. So, and then Huey, another thing is, they'll tell you how far. So, they'll, they'll might be in this parking garage. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Our, um, our, where we pick up the car is in the parking garage of our hotel. So, that was a win-win for me. So, yeah. So, I had like, love that. And then, um... Yeah, I'm sad we didn't really get to do too much activities. I mean, we still overall had fun. Like, the whole point was to get out. We went to a botanical um, garden. Ho oh, ho. Oh. Something. I don't know. <laughs> so, we went to a botanical garden. We went to the bombest beaches ever. We got to China Resort. We watched the Niner game and. That's all, that's all kind of that we wanted, a chill vacation. And beach. Yeah, we wanted to do the ATVs in Jurassic Park, but the kids are not really into that, nor did they want to do that. Um, all they wanted to do was the beach, and we ended up getting boogie I didn't boards. mind it. We got boogie boards, and they were on that all day. For the kids, that's like, they're fun, like they like that, so I'm like, whatever, I tried. Yeah, you knocked out, too. But I did get one of them. But I'm sad. Today's the last day. Um, overall, I really enjoyed this experience with my, my kids and, you know, what I mean? And, like, it was a... We, we definitely needed this, I feel like, because we do always come with the whole entire family when we do stuff. Even to go to Disneyland, it's like 15 of us. That's so. a hold up. I think if everybody were to come, we could need about three weeks here to actually do what we did. Yeah, because it, it slows us down done. a lot. Somebody's so. got to do their makeup. Another one's got to go to the bathroom. Another one is hungry. No, that's true. When you roll deep, it kind of like puts you behind a little bit. So I feel like this definitely was much needed, but I did miss my family. I miss, you know, everybody joining along with me. I, I come in a package deal, so. <sighs> It's fun. It was still fun though. I loved it. And yeah, until the next trip. So I just want to say shout out to you guys. If it wasn't for you guys, we wouldn't be where we're at right now getting to travel and do these things with my kids. I remember when I was like working at McDonald's and Metro PCS and I was living like paycheck to paycheck. I would never be able to afford to come to Hawaii. Not with my kids, not by myself, not anytime at all so and thank you god too because you blessed me so much so yeah but first before we go out to eat we're gonna get some shaved ice Come on the shore. Yay. you guys look at the sunset it's so beautiful my heart tells i love you so we just um, um sorry i got a doll whip and then i got shaved ice but like it looks so good let me grab a spoon so i can try okay so this is the shaved ice did you grab some food yeah sure. What did you say? <laughs> no, I'm like 
Say it again. You said, but mom, bullying is like throwing a rock in the ocean. No. You never know how deep it will <laughs> go. Delete that clip. Nope. That's what you said, right? <laughs> and then give me that smirk that you said. Yeah, I gave him smirk. By the way, you guys, I got uh, most of the kids' clothes from Shein. And then um, my clothes as well. Shein, because Shein is such a baller on a budget. Definitely re recommend for vacation, especially if you just want to wear like a one-time thing. Super, it's like fast clothing, you know, um, fast fashion. And so yeah, it's really like convenient and affordable. If you're gonna take a trip and you want new clothes, um, everything's like seven to twenty dollars. Um, so yeah, that's why I chose to do that. And after this. It could be recycled. If not, I'll just donate it. But I, all this was specifically for Hawaii, so they won't probably wear this in California, especially because it's winter right now. Well, to be honest, guys, over there in SoCal, we have like really bomb weather, so we'll see. Another we got our snow cone, we can head off to go eat because I'm starving. What is going on? Where'd you park, babe? Oh my god, you guys, this is my most favorite. Boy, it's like, here's the bag. Here. Don't um, do too much on your bags. I just can't refuse to Well, I think they already have one with them. We're walking the street. The parrots. They be pimping the fuck out these birds. Poor birdies. Um, we're trying to look, we're trying to look for our restaurant that we searched up. It's passing the Balenciaga store. I know. Mark my words. I'm gonna buy me. No, I'm gonna buy me that shit. That one. That exact one. And that Wimbledon. That middle one. That was nice. This chocolate face, this one's 54,000. Damn. Do you guys like them? Do you know what it is? Huh? Do you want one? Why? It's a waste of money. I could just go on my phone and see the time, right? The black one? It's because these are big boy things when you get older and you become rich. Yup. Yup, man. I got my shirt. That's the one that's the most important. That's the one? Oh. Yeah, this one too right here. And you guys, the weather is like perfect. You don't need a sweater. You know what, you guys change your plans. We're gonna eat at Cheesecake Factory. Because honestly, you guys, I made a mistake the other day and I couldn't find this restaurant and it was the freaking food court at the mall. And we ended up there again. Now my fault. <laughs> I do not want to eat at that shit again. So we're just gonna, but the kids are so happy they love cheesecake, huh boys? Yeah. I love cheesecake, it's, and I brought my tapatio, so I'm happy. But dude, this freaking strip is It is crazy. bougie and nice. It reminds me. This is Rodeo Drive, just uh... Or Beverly Hills, yeah, Beverly Hills. Uh, Rodeo Drive, right? That's where it's at? So we literally, you guys, this is what we ended up sticking with. Dude, we are gassed out. Tell them we're that. so we're tapped out. Oh my god, you guys, honestly, I just can't wait to just get back home. Even I'm so exhausted. Let me know, you guys, is burnt. I don't know if you can see the red around. Oh my god, you guys should see his back and his body. It's so burnt. My fucking hands, look at I don't know why that middle, he has that skin where it burns. I burn easy. I feel like I don't. I don't have that type of skin. You burn, but it takes a long time. I'll be in the sun for 30 minutes. But even then, I feel like I don't burn or tan really. Like it's hard. Right. Okay, yeah, so we ended up doing cheese cake, you guys. Okay. We were gonna go to this other spot. What was it? Like Hawaiian food? Dude, I don't know. It don't even exist. We're gonna end up at the food court again. <laughs> at the mall on the food court. We keep doing that shit, I'm like, fuck. No, the, the GPS is just a weird spot. 
So I got a margarita pizza for appetizer and I got a raspberry lemon drop. Grab, grab one. So you want a, a pizza? Okay, let me, let me help you. Okay, so this is my favorite when it comes to cheesecake. It is... Go ahead, you can do the whole thing. Um, uh, half of it. Now you're outside. Do you guys also have red pepper plates? Okay, I'll take some too. Yeah, can I get some? Thank you. Um, honestly, we love cheesecake factory. I Except when you door dash it. Don't door dash it or take it to go. You have, it's something that you need to eat like, on the spot. But you guys, honestly, I can't wait to go home and like, eat some authentic, real tacos or just homemade food in general. Dang, you guys are hungry, huh? You like it, baby? You want chile? No, they don't need chile. This one, look. Here, I have one open for you, here. So, Ramiro, what did you get, babe? Chicken marsala? Chicken marsala. She's fire. With mushrooms. So I have fucked up his brain. He didn't come to pay. And JJ, what happened? Did it? Food, buddy. I told you about the bread. You ate a lot of bread. And I don't know, low key and poor too. <laughs> Do that game again? Mm -mm, I don't want to do that again. I think what Justin Bieber did, do you remember that interview? No, what are you reminding me of? And then she was like, <laughs> about to let go of it, so then look at his hair. You just did that to me right now. We had a Justin Bieber moment. You know me and Justin Bieber had the same birthday? Wow. March 1st. I don't know why DJ keeps saying that we don't look like Adam Sandler. We're calling it a night. I don't know why. Another thing JJ always says is, how do you say Lamiro's name? Lamiro. He says it with an L. Lamiro. Like he's always, since he's met him, calls him Lamiro. But whatever. We packed up, guys. We're all packed. Ready to go. I'm sad. We're leaving Hawaii. This is the end. Saya's mood. My mood right now. You guys, look at Ramiro. He is burnt to the T. What the hell? I would not be flexing that. <laughs> you are burnt, buddy. Ramiro, it's not that bad when you see <laughs> Let me see, can I Oh my it's god, like you guys. It looks like a plate or something like that. Fuck, this shit hurts now. Look, come here, even your forehead. Dude, all right, yeah, we get it. I'm even burnt. Ramiro's forehead, look. Come here, show them. You guys, the middle is for it. I don't know if you can see. You can't really Dude, tell. Dude, my hands. The hands are the worst. This shit hella hurts right here. Oh my god, yeah, your hands are really red. Damn. Okay, guys, and this is it for our family trip. We're off. We got our boys. Everything packed. We're going to give those away, the board, since we can't take them back with it. So we're going to go find a family with kids that we can give that to. So they can have fun. Are you guys sad? Yeah. Sad. I also but they're also so funny when they go to the beach because like you're hitting the water. This isn't this like this is like you guys really really need this when you guys come to Hawaii for the kids. It's so fun because they ride the waves and. I chose the worst day to get burnt. This shit hurts. It's yeah. So burnt bad. I'm so burnt bad. This shit hurts so bad. How come I didn't get burnt? I don't know, you have toothpaste on the side of your uh, lips. So what was your guys' favorite part of the trip? This, this. Okay. Everything. I would like, I would say the weather was perfect. I mean, I would say all. Oh. I'd say Wai Manalo. Wai Manalo Beach is the best beach. Yep. I would say all the weather was perfect. Like, not for the certain days. Let's come to an end to the next one, boys.